What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Omega Ruby walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we captured a good old buddy, Terrakian. Yeah, captured that guy. And unfortunately, because it's still Saturday as I'm recording this, uh, we won't be doing anything for any other Pokemon until tomorrow and on Monday, so, you know, stay tuned for that one. Those episodes will be coming out. And like I said, guys, all these uh, legendary Pokemon episodes will not go in order because, you know, my schedule varies and all that stuff. So today we are going to go capture, uh, or in this episode, we're going to be capturing stationary Pokemon right here. Ter uh, not Terrakian, Heatran. If you guys don't remember who Heatran is, it is the legendary Pokemon of Sinnoh. It is both steel and fire type Pokemon. Looks kind of like the devil. Pretty cool. And I don't know why you're lagging, computer, but this has got to stop. And uh, yeah, we're going to go capture this guy. But of course, there's going to be a Kecleon on blocking our way right here. So let's go right ahead and go to the Scorch Lab. Try saying that ten times in a row. So as you guys can see, the, the Scorch Lab is this big old chunk of uh, rock right here. And originally, it was just a spot where you can find a secret base in here. But they added a stairway right here. And, uh, well, it looks like it's going to be a little more interesting than what it was before. So, here we found a TM-11 Sunny Day. Alrighty. And, well, you will be needing a Pokemon who knows Flash. So, let's see. Probably came in a little ill-prepared right here. So, let's go ahead and find that uh, Flash attack right here. Where in the good griefs are you? Let's see. Flash attack. So, I'm going to be teaching my Pokemon, uh, oh, well. Wow. Some of my, my main Pokemon uh, different moves just because, well, it really, like, uh, you know, I can always switch them up. A lot of their moves come from TMs anyway, so, it's, you know, we can go back and forth. And thankfully, the TMs in this game and well, coming into this game, it just, you know, it changed. So, I'm going to take that nature power away. I'm going to go with uh, that. And there we go. We got ourselves a Flash. Okay, so let's go right ahead and use Flash. Light this uh, whole place up right here because, yeah, we blind. We 30 years old, we're gonna get blind right here. Although I, I've never even needed glasses, guys. So there it is. Everything is nice and uh, illuminated again. Sorry for the lagginess, guys. You know, internet and all that crud. And here we found ourselves a full heal, a nice item that we can actually use for you know healing a Pokemon. And once you walk to this section right here, you're gonna find Flannery. Hiya! Well, hello there, baby. Huh. It might be impossible. Okay. So let's go ahead and talk to our gym leader girlfriend right here. Wow! Don't scare me like that. You scared the living daylights out of me. Huh. Anyway, by any chance did you come here to look for a rare Pokemon too? Yes. And maybe you. I don't know. You too. Oh, I see. As you may have heard, this this cave has long been rumored to be a place uh, where a fire, a rare fire type Pokemon lives. And that's why I'm here, or that's why I came here. But I guess I was a, uh, a bit ill prepared. I was thinking about going back to Lava Ridge and coming back later. So I'm leaving now. But if you go farther, please be careful. Whatever you say, baby. Hmm. 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 Flannery, you, 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 you just, you, you're just a breath of fresh air. That's all I got to say right there. Anywho, uh, let's see. Do I have any more repels right here? Because I could have sworn I... Eh, well, probably wasted all the repels. Good gravy. Okay, so let's go ahead and see if we have any repels. And, uh... Well, it looks like good old Draven came ill-prepared himself. Because he probably wasted a, 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 his last super repel. Oh, crud. Yeah. I think I... Ah, oh, shoots. Okay. So, yeah, I wasted uh, the last Super Repel. So, we might we might get attacked by a few Pokemon here and there. But it is okay. It's fine. It's fine. I'm just going to... I'm just going to be here to explore. Now, let's see. I'm just going to switch this up. And, uh, yeah, we've caught every single Pokemon that is being offered into this place. Which is only Zubats and Golbats. So, it's really nothing that big. And, uh, well, would you look at that? We're going to get attacked by a Golbat. Chances are you might find a shiny gold bat Zubat around here. So if you do, comment down below. You know, it'll be great. And well, let's see. I see a uh, I see a mega stone right there. So let's go right ahead and grab it. See what it is. And we found ourselves the Charizardite Y, which can be used to evolve any Charizard 
to its Y Mega form right there. If you guys haven't checked out my Pokemon, uh, let's see, my Pokemon uh, Let's Go Pikachu walkthrough, I've done that already. So you guys can get a, a good look at what uh, what Mega Pokemon come out. And uh, well, the only thing you guys really need here is a Pokemon that knows Surf and Strength. And that's it. And don't forget Flash. Yeah, you, know, you got. You, you guys can't forget Flash right here. So, uh, let's see. Golbat, you are not... You are not going to stop me from where I'm going to be going. So, let's go right ahead and uh, move on ahead right here. Again, lagginess. Good gravy. Now, let's see. Where in the Mother Lover is... Oh, there it is. Okay, so as you can see, there's a big old hole right there. And uh, that is where you're going to be finding a legendary Pokemon. A rare Pokemon. I don't know if it's actually a legendary or anything like that. I don't know. Is it really a legendary? I don't know. Okay, so first and foremost, let's go right ahead and save our game because, again, we do not want to miss out on any of these Pokemon right here. Now, the other thing, too, is since we do have a Pokemon that knows Thunder Wave, kind of learned that the hard way in the last episode, I'm going to start off with Hydra, too. It's so hot that you can't stop sweating. Merely breathing is difficult. That is true. Okay, so here we are, and look at that. There is a portal right ahead. Again, I'm going to try and save this game again because, yeah, I don't, I, I don't want this guy to run away. Or it's not going to run away, it's just I don't want to screw it up. So press that thing right there. A mysterious ring is floating in the air. Something is visible deep in the hole. Giggity. Would you, would you like to put your hand deep in the hole? Giggity. Yes. Okay, so let's go ahead and press that button. And if you guys can hear that theme song, look at that. Heatran has appeared. Now, Heatran is a unique typing right here. It is both a fire and steel type Pokemon. So it just, well, it covers itself pretty well. It's very, very bulky. And it's very, very tough to actually beat. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to paralyze it because I can. And, well, look at that. It's paralyzed. Now, the main thing is I, I cannot make this Pokemon faint. I cannot make him faint because that, that's going to be bad right there. Very, very bad. So, let's go with a... Let's see. Let's go ahead and switch out. Let's go with Flufflet right here. Yeah, okay. Now, last episode, I actually thought Flufflet knew, like, uh, Dragon Breath. But that was uh, not the case right there. So, here comes a metal sounder. I don't know what it is. Look at that. The, the special defense has gone down uh, sharply. So... Let's go with a Dragon Pulse. Hopefully this guy does not faint. Again, it's a Steel type, so you can physically hit it. And look at that. It'll tank some moves right there. And, well, since it's paralyzed, it's pretty good right there now. So let's see how its special uh, attack is. So here we go with the Moon Blast. And nothing. Wow, this Pokemon, its special attack goes down. Okay, so, yeah, we're going to have a tough time trying to bring this Pokemon down just because it is a very, very tough Pokemon. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so let's go right ahead and switch it out to Tank right here. And hopefully, just hopefully, uh, it will actually put a dent in this Pokemon's uh, armor right here. All right, what's up? How you doing? Heatran is paralyzed, and, well, let's go right ahead and use a Body Slam. Come on, come on. Body slam. Okay, so it's doing its job. It's, it, 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 it was a critical hit, so we're just going to have to grind it out right here with this guy. So again, body slam. And okay, so hopefully no, no uh, what you would call it, uh, critical hits by from here on in. So here we go again, body slam. Come on. And it's on red. Okay, so... Yeah, we are not going to attack it ever again because uh, we don't want to miss out on this Pokemon. So, since we are in a cave, I think we do have some Dust Balls around here somewhere. No, we got Timer Balls. So, yeah, we're just going to throw some Timer Balls. Come on! Stay in the Pokeball. Stay in the ball! Ah, oh, damn. Now, off screen, when I was actually playing Pokemon Alpha Zapphire, this Pokemon happened to be one of like, the toughest Pokemon to capture. Do not know why. I just, uh... I always have time with I always have a hard time with Pokemon with like strong defenses. It's just really annoying. So here we go. Come on, stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Damn you, Heatran. Okay, so again, Lava Plume takes its effect right here. 
Tank is taking it out. And here we go. Timer ball. Let's go. Again, buy yourself a lot of timer balls, dust, bo uh, dust balls, and everything. And yes! There we go, guys. We caught ourselves Heatran. Okay. Alrighty. So that wasn't that hard. Look at that. And my Pokemon to gain experience points, and Heatran's data has gone into my Pokedex right here. I cannot speak very well because I'm excited about this. So, here it is, guys. Heatran. It is. Well, it's a female? Huh. I didn't know this guy had a. or this chick had a sex. So, here it is, guys. Heatran, the fire and steel type Pokemon. It is 5 feet, 7 inches, 948 pounds of pure muscle. It dwells in volcanic caves. It digs in with uh, its cross-shaped uh, feet to crawl on ceilings and walls. Oh, damn, that's a scary Pokemon right there. And uh, no, I'm not going to give it a nickname because, nah, not really. Okay, so I do have an escape rope right here, so I kind of need to get the heck out of here because I do not want to just, like, encounter any more Pokemon right there. So I'm going ahead and finding that escape rope wherever the heck it is. Where are you? Come on, I know I have one escape rope. At least one! Jeebus, okay. I got a whole bunch of, uh... Yeah, I got a whole bunch of, uh... What you call it? Uh, Mega Stones? Uh, never mind. Okay, so we're gonna have to go... We're gonna get to, We're gonna have to go the hard way. And that is... By foot and everything. And everything is not illuminated anymore. So we're just gonna have to go upstairs. Get the F away. There's, uh, some water right there. Let's go ahead and fish. Just like cut corners right here. Look at that. We're cutting corners. And let's see. We're going up. And we're out. Okay, so that was a pretty good episode right there, I guess. I don't know. It's a pretty, pretty, pretty good episode. So let's see. We finally caught another Pokemon. And it's a few hours before I have to capture the next few. So what is going to happen right now, guys, is. Let's see. I kind of want to capture all three in the same time, in the same day. And that might, that might, now, I might, that might have to wait until tomorrow. So, what I'm going to do in the next episode, it's been a long time coming. We're going to go straight to Petalburg City. Or, was it Petalburg City? Where is my dad located? Right here. Yes, we're going to go to Petalburg City because, yeah, we actually actually got something a while back a few months ago that will enable us to capture another legendary Pokemon if you guys know what it is you'll know what it is so thank you guys again for watching this episode I will see you guys next